Hello and welcome to the channel. I trust you are all well. Today we're going to tie a nymph which is designed for the dropper. It's a nymph that can be used all the year round and catches many fish. It's a very simple tying. In the vise I have a size 16 round bend nymph hook and a 2.8 nickel or black tungsten bead and I'm using 8 ho to mount the fly. So let's start with tying on the bead. Like so. And then winding the thread down, trimming off the excess. and winding it down around the bend. Like so. And I'm going to tie in a wire rib. And in this instance, it is green wire. And it's a uh, zero, zero 009. Very fine, but does the job perfectly. So I'm just going to tie that in, pull that to length, and wind it down around the bend. Right now, at the end of the video, I will be giving you information about the Christmas drawer and how it will work and how long it will last. Right now, I'm just going to tie down the wire rib. Up to the bead. Like so, and I'm just gonna push that a little bit further around into the vise now. And build up a little bit of body. down to the bend of the hook. Right now for the body I'm going to use a fine dubbing and this is a beaver dubbing. Now I would normally use this on dry flies but it is very very fine and it's perfect for this particular fly and the bead will of course negate the the flotation capability. So I'm going to put on a fine noodle of this uh, dubbing. Let's see how we get on with that. And wind it round the bend and up the shank of the hook. Just tighten that up a little bit. Doesn't want to play ball. Going to put on just a little bit more to complete the uh, the body wrap. Like so. And now I'm going to wind on the green wire as a, a rib in open wraps. the thorax area and tie it off and that should helicopter off right now as this is a black and peacock nymph of course we need some peacock dubbing and that's what I'm going to take out here And make a rope of peacock dubbing. You can hopefully see the flash, which is the attractor.
It's a really simple tie. Simple but effective. Tighten up that W. Create a nice collar. I'm going to put on just a little bit more, just to finish off the collar. Like so. Right, I'm going to tie it off, but before I do that, I'm going to put a little bit of glue onto the thread. Tied off like so. And trim up the tying thread. And I'm just going to brush out the thorax. To make it buggy. I'll put that back in the vise like so. And there you have the finished nymph, the black and peacock nymph. It's a terrific dropper fly. Certainly can be used throughout the year and will catch lots of fish. Now, the competition. The competition will run from today through to the 31st of December. And there will be three prizes. The first prize will be a channel t-shirt, a buff, a trapper cap, a waterproof fly box with a selection of flies, a hen's hare's ear selection with 12 different colours, and some gold round tinsel to help with your tying. The second prize will be a channel t-shirt, a buff, an enigma cap, a waterproof fly box, 25 size 16 light nymph hooks and 25 2.8 beads and some flat copper tinsel. Third prize will be a channel t-shirt, 25 size 14 light nymph hooks and 25 3.3 beads. And I'll also put in a pheasant tail. So they are the three prizes. And all you have to do on this video only is put in the answer to your question. And the question is, how many autonomous regions are there in Spain, including the archipelagos? How many autonomous regions are there in Spain? Very simple question requires a simple answer and just put it in this video only. And in the new year, I'll tell you who the winners are. I'll video the draw and we'll go from there. I hope you enjoyed this time. And if you're not already a subscriber, please uh, hit the bell and uh, pass a comment if you so wish. Give it a like and thanks for viewing. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.